Hey people, this is the do that show and today I'm gonna show you how to use MDF forms and they can be very useful when you want a form to come inside another form. So you first of all open Visual Basic, then you click on new project, select the forms application and rename it whatever you want. I'll just make it how to use MDI forms um, forms for YouTube. Oh. Sorry, this is already created. Let me first delete it, then I'm just make it. Uh, wait a second, sorry. Mm. Mm, I don't know what's the problem. Okay, I'll just make it how to use MDA forms. Uh, then you click on enter, and you click on and your size whatever size you want I'll just make it this big and in the properties uh, you go to is MDI container you find it and change it to true once you have done this you just go to project add windows form and add a form 2.pb and then go again from 1.pb and add the tool strip tool strip right click and add button change this display style to text and now just change it text to um, add MDI form now double click on this button and write the code that then child form as new form 2 new form 2 now write child form dot MDI parent equals to me uh, child from dot show. Once you have added this, you just debug the program and once you add this, the blank form. And now here it is another forms. Uh, you can just close these forms, maximize them, or minimize them. It will just go down like this maximize normal and you can do anything that you want thanks for watching